From the studios at WBONTV.com, here is what's happening. A flood advisory for the Kentucky River near Ravenna is in effect until late Saturday night. Low-lying areas including Red Lick Road, Miller's Creek Road, Dark Holler Road, and Nolan Creek Road are expected to flood in several places. The flood advisory is extended for the Red River Clay City until this afternoon. Due to a generous pledge of $1,500 late Wednesday by Father Jim Sitchko, our GoFundMe campaign to replace Hunter, the Estill County search and rescue dog that was killed just a few weeks ago, have not only been raised, but exceeded. Renfro Collision is making good on their $1,000 challenge, bringing the total raised to over $6,000. Father Sitchko was formerly priest at St. Mark Church in Richmond, Hunter's trainer says a new puppy will be brought in next week. A Madison County man is now facing charges that include 30 counts of alleged sex crimes. Police say 26-year-old Dylan Minch is charged with 20 counts of possession of child pornography and 8 counts of using a minor under the age of 16 in a sexual performance. Yesterday, the Business at Noon Luncheon was held on the EKU campus with several political figures attending. Gubernatorial candidate Robert Goforth attended and discussed several items he's proposed as a representative. I have several key pieces of legislation I would like to get passed, uh, such as the fetal heartbeat bill that bans abortion after a heartbeat is detected, the public protection bill, and then I hope that we take a slower approach and more methodical approach to fixing the pension system. Goforth represents District 89. For more stories like these, tune to WBONTV.com. I'm Ron Likens.